What's going on guys? Hope you're having a wonderful day, enjoying life while it lasts. One of the most fun ways I come up with song ideas is by beatboxing, so I thought a couple weeks ago wouldn't it be interesting to streamline that process and go directly from a beatbox that's recorded to a click into a track that directly emulates that beatbox. So that's what we're doing today, I'm going to record a beatbox and then I'm going to try to emulate it with real synthesizers and drums and all that, and the end product will look something like a lip sync, but with beatboxing. So let's get into it. <laughs> So first things first, I cut out the good take, compressed it, denoised it, now it sounds like this. And I'm just gonna keep it there on the project, probably lock the clip in place so that I can see it as I work on making these sounds. So first I'm gonna take those sounds at the beginning that I kind of make out of time and find sounds for those. Let's go. Alright, so I've got all the basic drum sounds here, and so this is now this. So what's really going to be fun is trying to figure out how to make the more interesting sounds, like when I do this. What does that mean? So, uh, yeah, let's continue. So it's the next day, there are a lot of really interesting sounds that I've made since yesterday, since that last clip you saw, and I want to show you one of them real quick, this breath thing. So sometimes I take these big, loud breaths, and what I've done is basically an open hi-hat for that sound, but it's slightly reversed, so it's kind of cool. And then I really want to show you this sound over here as well. We've got this like big triplet thing that ends in some sort of weird thing that I do with my mouth, uh, and it sounds like this. <laughs> And it's really weird, like, what does that actually mean? How is that going to translate into a real produced beat? And this is actually a problem that I have to deal with a lot here. This is like the whole, the whole thing is this, is trying to figure out what exactly did I envision when I was beatboxing? What did I really mean by the sound that I'm making with my mouth? What is that supposed to be in the produced version? So I get a little bit of creativity, but I'm trying to keep it as in line with what I was really thinking in the moment as I can, which of course is difficult, but it's not impossible because I, I did it myself. I can kind of remember what I was thinking. So here's the sound. Something that's important to note and remember when you listen to the final product is that this is lip syncing, this is not just simply transcribing the beatbox. So that's all I'm doing right now, but I'm going to add more stuff to it, because lip syncing is not doing the entire song, it's just doing one part. So if you think it like a lip syncing singer is only lip syncing the vocal, they're not lip syncing the drums and the chords and everything else. So similarly, this is only lip syncing the drums, and that's what I'm doing right now, but I'm gonna add more stuff, so there's gonna be other things in here that I'm not doing with mouth, but it's lip syncing. So that's, that's what's going on. All right, so a lot of work has been done. We are now onto this part. So I have to figure out a sound for that. What is mean. I have to figure that out. You know, I have something in mind and I remember kind of what I was thinking when I was beatboxing it, but uh, the main thing is probably going to be brass and a dubstep bass. So we're going to look for like that deep trombone sound, the boah, you know, at, like Inception or something. Big noise coming soon to a speaker near you. And then some dubstep, like really gnarly bass sound. And uh, yeah, let's see how it goes. It is now day three and I have finished all the leads and harmonies and whatnot besides the bass and the drums which were from the beatboxing. So I'll give you a quick example of what the transformation looks like between the beatbox and the produced version and then I'll give you the whole thing.
That was cool. Congratulations on still being alive. While you're alive, you might as well follow me on social media. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video. I certainly enjoyed the video. I'm really happy with what we ended up with. I had a lot of fun making it. So yeah, see you next time. Bye.